Hello everybody, this is a video about tactile boats. Um, tactile 21 and 19 boats will be in this video. They are commercial boats, work boats for crab fishing. They're designed to be quite fast. The old boats used to be a lot slower. So these particular boats have been designed um, for a bit more speed, but they've got the robustness of the previous boats. Um, so, so the hull is manufactured with aft engine well, glass fibre matrix for girders, marine plywood and glass fibre seal rules. Gunwales are made from marine ply, encapsulated with glass fibre. The foredeck, whale bag and bulkhead create a dry locker. These items are fabricated before the hull is extracted from the mould tool. This constitutes a classic boat. So, the specifications uh, for the Tactile 21 uh, 6.4 metres long, beam 2.2 metres. It's got a free board of 800 mil, floor to gunwale 900 mil, uh, working area of 6 square metres, and the keel to water line unlaid is 250 mil. The dry weight is approximately 425 kilograms and the power unit for the Tactile 21 recommended is 40, 50, 60 or 70 horsepower engines. You can have a twin, you have like twin 40s or twin 60s, twin 30s or something like that. It says the recommendation would be a 60 horsepower. Um, tactile 19 um, can also have up to um, 60 horsepower as recommended. Uh, you can get um, optional extras like a stainless steel keel band, stainless steel all apart, steering console, spray screens, etc. etc. Um, the Tactile 19 is slightly, obviously slightly shorter, it's 5.8 metres long, 2.2 beam. It's, so it's the same beam as the Tactile 21, it's the same freeboard as a Tactile 21, same floor to gunwale as a Tactile 21, slightly smaller, square metre working area, same keel or line, and the dry weight is slightly it's, it's, um, 75 kilograms less, it's about 350 kilograms. Yeah, so they're just they're pretty much um, designed for crab fishing, launching off the beach in rough weather. Solid as. Absolutely solid as. It's got a nice little, nice little crab boat there. Don't prefer the GoPro really. Some. I really don't. I don't know. Oh. Sure. Do with the clean. But um, yeah, it's the same boat, it's the same make. Look at that, look. I can, I can, that's where this rope's been hossing through it. That's had some use. It's got a nice keel band on it, look. It's got some nice windows. Yeah. It's the tactile. I've never heard of them. I've never heard of them, but. There you go, there's more down here, look. One hit. Very solid, 
solid crown boat this. Very solid. Tactile marine. There you go. Or just custom, a custom built heavy duty crab boat for launching off the beach. You can see it, you can see what the terrain's like. You need a little tractor look. You need a, a strong keel band on the boat. And you can see all the knocks and bangs they've had there, but they're so built, those are tough. But they're expensive. There you go, it's got twin look. Got back up. And look at the prop look. All the dents in his prop. Look, look all the dents in his prop look. Need a new prop, mate. Look, you snapped the skeg off that one, look. Skeg, look, it's been snapped. That's because of all that, all these stones. It's very rocky out here, actually. So you can see, he's got his little radar arch at the back. Crab pots. There you go. There you go. High sides, beamy. Nice little work boat. There you go.